In the Old Testament, God our Father created all of the heavens, the earth, the moon, the sun, and the stars. He created creatures great and small, and He created men in His image. God created all things in pattern of His love. He sent His only Son, Jesus, to fall in His footsteps. The wise men followed the patterns and the Lord started to find the baby Jesus. Noah followed the pattern that God sent to him to build an ark to save the animals during the great flood. Moses was given a pattern of commandments by God to follow, to obey, and to show our love to God. Patterns have been around since God's creation. Patterns have been around for hundreds of years and can be seen or heard all around the world. Come journey with the second grade class as we look for the patterns in the sky. Places. 
Neighbors Garage, the alley behind 7-Eleven, Missouri, no luck. But we're not going up. But let's straighten our heads now. I'm much better. Now we can look up at the moon. Isn't it supposed to be a full moon tonight? That means werewolves. Oh, we're not werewolves. We're were chickens. Yeah, werewolves most of the time. Or 
was a full moon appears than blood moon chicken. Happy day now, Baba, Baba. We wear chickens. Don't hurt anyone. We just love, love, love the moon. Because planets have their own power. 
for what God has done for us this Thanksgiving season. We hope you enjoyed our play, have a happy Thanksgiving, and look for patterns in the sky. and I have to say this is their first time coming on stage and they did an amazing job so take a bow sorry my <laughs> take a bow and we would all clap for you hope everybody's clapping for them they did such an amazing job so I'm so so proud of you guys such a great job and we want to thank Sister Kathy for um, the uh, arts program here at um, Our Lady of the Hamptons especially during this time it was a really nice joyous thing for them. The kids were so excited to do this and they just enjoy it. So thank you to Sister Kathy. We're a little more sorry. <laughs> Trying to get in the middle here. Um, so we're thankful Sister Kathy. Um, thank you to Ms. Hanley and the seventh graders for allowing us to come into their classroom and, and you know um, 
practicing, so that was you know tough for the seventh grade. So we're thankful for that. So thank you, Ms. Hanley, in the seventh grade. Thank you to the eighth grade crew that's been helping us, the stage crew. Thank you so much for everything, for setting everything up. We really appreciate it. So thank you. Thank you to Ms. Marsha, Ms. Zeckel, um, Ms. Kennedy, who helped with lines, play lines, um, decorations, um, dances. So thank you so much to them as well. Um, for Ms. Doyle and Mrs. Um, Lucenti did the um, play decorations. So thank you so much um, for the beautiful decorations. They did such a great job. And to all the parents with the play lines that they helped with, the costumes, the donations, it was really, really appreciated. So thank you so much. We hope everybody has an amazing Thanksgiving and enjoy the rest of the afternoon. And thank you for spending time with us today for our, our second grade play. So thank you. job that they did. It's very, very difficult when you had no place to really practice the early parts. And the hardest part is that I know you can all sing every one of those songs. You do know the words, right? Yes. Yeah, I know. So someday we'll take the masks off and we'll just shout it from the housetops. But you had a good science lesson. You learned a lot of things. So congratulations to all of you and your teachers. You did a wonderful job. Thanks for everything. Have a good weekend.